The Story of a Dirty Child The little girls, whom now you'll see, were sisters in one family, and both enjoyed an equal share of a kind mother's anxious care. This one in neatness took a pride, and oft the brush and comb applied, oft washed her face and oft her hands. See now, thus occupied she stands. The other, oh, I grieve to say, how she would scream and run away, soon as she saw her mother stand with water by and sponge in hand. She'd kick and stamp and jump about and set up such an awful shout that one who did not know the child would say she must be going wild. In consequence, it came to pass, while one was quite a pretty lass and many a fond admirer gained and many a little gift obtained, the other, viewed with general scorn, was left forsaken and forlorn, for no one can endure to see a child all dirt and misery. Behold how needful tis that we should clean in dress and person be. Or else, believe me, tis in vain we hope affection to obtain. A sloven will be always viewed with pity by the wise and good, while even the vicious and the base behold with scorn a dirty face.